Andrea Cavanato, Zebre travel to Wales looking for their second win of the season, having already beaten Cardiff at the Arms Park in round three. Dion Berryman, David Giazon, and centre Gonzalo Garcia returned to the starting lineup. The last time these sides met, Dragons had just a point to spare in Italy last February. The Welshmen had won both of their home matches so far this season. Lynn Jones and Darren Edwards had rung the changes in their starting line-out with a number of frontline players back in the starting 15. Jason Toby returned at out half in place of Chris Burton. And in the 13th minute, Zebre gave away a needless penalty for coming in from the side, almost in front of the posts. And Toby was on the mark to make it 3-0. Soon after it was 6-0, Toby Falotau made a good break and when Zebre were penalised for coming in from the side yet again, the left-footed Toby knocked another kick over the bar. Leonardo Sarto went close to going over for Zebre's first points of the match midway through the first half as the play moved from one side of the pitch to the other, only to be denied by a solid tackle by Dan Evans. When the Zebra scrum was penalised on the half hour, it gave Toby another chance to extend Dragon's lead. His kick was good, and it was nine points to nil. Just on half time, the news got worse for Zebra. They made a mess off their own scrum and in front of their own line. Winger Hallam Amos was in the right place to take advantage and get over for the first try of the match. It was a critical blow for the Italians. And when Toby converted, it gave the Welshmen a 16 points to nil half-time lead. Into the second half, Dragons were well in control and British and Irish line Toby Falatau did particularly well off the back of the scrum before finding Toby, who in turn offloaded to Amos, who got over for his and Dragons' second try of the match. Toby converted to make it 23-0 with 50 minutes on the clock. Zebre got their first points of the night on the hour mark. Winger Sarto was always a danger and after a perceptive crossfield kick by Brendan Leonard, Sarto did really well to get the touchdown despite the presence of Amos. Luciano Orquera landed the conversion to leave the scores 23-7. Zebre's cause then took a blow when the influential Mauro Bergamasco was sent to the bin. And from the resulting set-piece, Dragon sealed the win in the 65th minute when after a good Welsh shove, Lewis Evans drove over for the third try of the game, which Toby converted to leave a final score of 30 points to 7. Dragons unable to add to their three-try tally for a bonus point, but it was an historic 100th win for the home side at Rodney Parade. Zebra have Heineken Cup games to look forward to now, while Dragons' next outing is a Pro 12 Welsh derby against Ospreys. Final score at Rodney Parade. Newport went Dragons 30, Zebra 7.